In part B, we want to compare the electric field amplitude at z equals zero and some depth, z equals question, where we have attenuated, once the wave has propagated this to this depth, it's attenuated by 40 decibels, which means, since it's attenuating, it decreases by 40 decibels. So we're going to say minus 40 dB. So over here, let's write minus 40 dB, and that's going to be equal to a comparison of the electric field amplitude at that distance, z, versus the surface. And since we're comparing the amplitude, I'm going to put absolute value here. And since there's a propagation delay from when the wave is at z equals zero versus z equals some depth into the ocean, it helps to make this comparison in the sinusoidal steady state. So I'm going to put a vector here because there's a direction associated with it and a phasor. So we're going to do this comparison in the phasor domain. And since we have electric fields, when we, we want to convert this to decibels, and since we have electric fields, we have to multiply by 20 to get to decibels. So 20 log base 10. And that's the expression that we need to evaluate. So first we could divide both sides by 20, for example then we get minus 2 dB, and that is equal to what's left. Then we could take each side to the power of 10, so we get 10 to the minus 2, that's to get rid of this log base 10 here, and on the right we end up with E vector phasor at Z over E vector phasor at 0. And then from part A, we have an expression for the electric field, so we can use that. It's x hat 5 e to the minus 0.2z, and I'm going to leave off that part with the beta because we don't care about the phase, we have the amplitude. And on the denominator, we have x hat 5 e to the minus 0.2 times 0, and that's equal to 10 to the minus 2. Now we can take well, first of all, we can cancel the x-hats and cancel the fives, and we end up with 10 to the minus 2 is equal to e to the minus 0.2z. So at this point, we can take the natural logarithm of each side to get rid of the expo exponential term. So we get ln 10 to the minus 2 is equal to 0.2 z, and we can solve now for z, z is 23 meters.